guys welcome back to the channel and as I told you I am in Singapore for a couple of months working with CEO suit uh, from uh, impress.ie so I thought to align for you a couple of videos with him where he can explain what he does how he did it so here for you he is um, story on how a startup can actually sell to huge corporations around the world. You ask me how we made our first sale to an enterprise. Now that we work with a lot of large enterprises, how did we get started? So about three years ago when we started Impress, uh, we were just three people, three co-founders. Today we are four co-founders, back then it was just the three of us building the whole company from scratch. And it was tough. I mean, we, we didn't have any resources, we had a big idea, and we didn't have any customers. So what we did is we started pitching. We started pitching to the brands that we wanted to be associated with. We wrote a lot of emails. I, I use a lot of email automation uh, to get meetings. And the, the first company we talked to is a large, it's one of the largest enterprises in Singapore. And we got some meetings with them. We pitched to a few people there. But nothing was moving because we were so small and for large enterprises to trust a small company is actually pretty hard because they would think that, okay, what if this startup goes bust, right? Uh, we start working with them and they're not around in a few months, what are we going to do? So it was very difficult and important to overcome that barrier of credibility. So what I did with the first sale is after pitching to uh, you know, some of the officials in that company, in the HR department, uh, I went to this event where the CEO of the group was speaking. And as soon as the CEO came down from the stage, I went up to, to him and introduced myself and what my company was doing. And immediately he stops and gives me his card. He says, write to me, I want to know more about this. At the same day, I sent him an email and turns out he forwarded that email and asked questions about uh, you know, what, what the company, what the HR department had heard from us about our product. Within, within a few weeks of this exchange over email, we had a verbal agreement with the, with the company that they're going to go ahead and explore further collaboration with Impress. So that's the story of how we made our first sale to a large enterprise and we've continued with that story through further hustle, through a lot of hard work and today uh, it's, we have uh, tens of large enterprises clients and uh, we continue to grow.